Greetings everyone, this is Danny from hardtravel.com, your luxury all-inclusive experts. And today, I'm at the beautiful Sandals Halcyon Beach. Now, Halcyon means peace and tranquility, and that's what they're going for here on the resort. It's a sprawling resort, you've got a beautiful beach, all the incredible Sandals restaurants that you would expect. And in addition to that, you've got the fantastic water sports, pools, and restaurants. But like any great resort, it's the people that make all the difference. The staff here is fantastic and they can't wait to welcome you to have a perfect romantic getaway. Follow along as we tour the resort. As you arrive to the resort, right as you head past reception, you're gonna end up at this beautiful spot. It is the main pool. And of course, every main all-inclusive pool has to have an awesome swim up bar. You've got one right here. The bartenders are fantastic. They're gonna make you smile, keep you happy, and keep the drinks flowing, of course. There's actually seating behind as well. You've got low top tables and chairs. You also have a bar on the other side. Now it's a pretty good sized pool. It wraps all the way around on this side. And then over here, there's bench seating throughout as well. You've got your classic loungers and umbrellas. They're gonna have drink service right here. And what's great is you also have food service right off to the side as well. There's a bandstand over the corner. They'll use that as part of their theme night sometimes. Sometimes that's gonna be in the nightclub. They set it out throughout the resort actually, but it's where you're gonna have music throughout the day as well. You've got a hot tub tucked away, but what's so great about this particular pool is you are right on the beach. In fact, I can hear the waves behind me right now. You can see Kelly's Dockside Restaurant in the distance, but it's that perfect setting right in the middle of the resort. Now keep in mind, there's other parts of the resort that are a little quieter and they're spread out, and we're gonna show you those as well. Set just across from the main pool, you're gonna find the Irie Bar right behind me. This is open in the evening every day. It services the nightclub, it also services Bayside Restaurant, and it's a great place to hang out. As you would expect, all around the resort, they have fun and games happening. You've got ping pong over there, you've got a game of Jenga, and then one of my favorite things, before you go into dinner or just hanging out in the evening, play a little pool, let's see what I got today. Yeah, I'm neither solids nor stripes. You're up, Taylor. Now set just above the Irie Bar, you have this fantastic lounge option. What I love, you got the stairs that head up to the top. You've got great views all throughout the resort and of course, the beautiful ocean in the distance. It's that fantastic place to gather before dinner or after dinner to grab a cocktail. Now we're headed out to one of my favorite restaurants at any Sandals Resort. That's Kelly's Dockside Over the Water Restaurant. It's an incredibly popular choice. You've got seafood, steaks, different kind of grill recipes is what they specialize in. But I did want to point out that this is one of those restaurants that a lot of people love that are staying at Grand St. Lucian and also at Sandals La Toc. Now you have those interchange privileges so you can stay at one, play at all three. So if you want to head on over to Grand St. Lucian, for example, and take advantage of some of the awesome options there, you definitely can when staying here. Now let's head inside and let me show you this beautiful space. Now we're inside this beautiful restaurant. You can see why it is such a fan favorite. You have a modern nautical theme, absolutely beautiful, all the clean lines, and of course the tribute to everything nautical here. You're gonna have mixed grill seafood, mixed grill steaks. I had a fantastic, in fact, the signature is a mixed grill with lamb, chorizo, steak, and chicken. I had that last night, it was really good. And what's interesting about this restaurant, the way they set it up, is of course you have all of your appetizers to choose from, but then from there, you're gonna be able to mix and match all the different sauces and the grilled meats. It's a fantastic option here on site, and of course, like all the restaurants, they've got a full bar. Had a few drinks last night. <laughs> it was a lot of fun actually. Complimented the, the, the meal with wine as well. They were able to pair that for us. Just a fantastic place to dine. The beach here at Sandals Halcyon is a beautiful stretch. It's nice and spread out. I really like they have a very long way all the way down to the end there. And then it extends really far in the other direction. What you're gonna find down on the beach are these palapas. So they've got shade structures with the different loungers. And one of my favorite parts of being in a butler level suite is they can actually set one of those up for you even before you get up in the morning. They'll come down, they'll get it set, they'll stock the cooler exactly to your preferences. So you come down and enjoy it whenever you like. But of course, this is open to any of the guests here on the resort. You've got the day beds that have the shade structure that folds up. Of course, you're gonna have traditional umbrellas and loungers as well. Now, as we continue along the beach, they do bring some of the sports and things down here, but my favorite part of any sandals beach and, and well, ocean experience is heading out to the floating rings. It's kind of like your own personal catamaran in the ocean. You've got the foam rings around it. You can lay in there. I may have fallen asleep in one or two of those from time to time. But once again, it's all about your vacation the way that you want it. If you love the pools, spend the day in the pools. If you love the beach and the ocean, you can spend your day down here as well. 
Now, one of the reasons so many of our guests choose Sandals Resorts is for all of the inclusions. They are considered the most inclusive of all of the brands, and it's because they include a ton of water sports in addition to the food and drink and all the things that you would expect to be included. You've got the stand-up paddle boards, you've got the kayaks, you're also gonna have the Hobie Cats and sailboats you can take out, once again, included and complimentary, or one of my favorites, water skiing or wakeboarding. Once again, all of that is included with your fare. In addition to that, they also have a ton of inclusions when it comes to scuba. That's really rare. You almost never see that in the all-inclusive world. So of course, they're gonna have all of the different things that you need, the equipment as, as well. But what I wanted to point out that it is complimentary. So if you're already certified, you come on down, set it up and you're ready to go. If you're not yet certified, they also have a practice dive pool right behind me here. See, they kind of have it set up in stadium style so that they can teach you. It really is a great learning experience. So you can come down, get certified, and then head out and take advantage of one of the incredible dive sites here on St. Lucia. In addition to all of that, they do have some upgrades, night dives and things along those lines. But if you're interested in water sports, all of that is included in your fare. Two other water sport options that I love are Big Mabel, where they can tow behind the boat. So it's kind of that combination, maybe a little more chill version of water skiing, if you will. It's a lot of fun. And of course, they also always include snorkeling. So they'll take you right on out. There's several reefs right around here. There's also some dive sites and reefs further away. But whatever it is that you're looking for in the water sports arena, they've got it here at Sandals Halcyon Beach. It's the little touches that go the furthest. And what we've noticed is all of the staff are constantly not only attending to your personal needs, but having little touches like this throughout the resort where they use the plant life and things that are already falling on the ground to make a beautiful piece of art. Now, what I love about this particular resort is that it completely transforms from daytime to evening. So during the day, of course, you can take advantage of the incredible beach and the pools and all of that, but they have several of these fire pits. They're perfect social settings. You see, you've got three couches right here. They'll turn that on later in the evening. There's a couple more of them, but it's once again, a perfect place to go to have a cocktail before dinner, hang out after dinner, or just relax anytime. Set on the far side of the resort, right on the beach, you're gonna find the Beach Bistro. This is a casual eatery that you can take advantage of during the day. It opens up later in the morning, goes into early evening. You can find all the traditional things, the burgers, those types of things you're gonna find right here on the beach. But of course, you gotta try some of the seafood here. It's been awesome throughout the resort. Now, what's unique about this particular space is that it reopens after dinner and it goes until late in the morning. So if you happen to be in one of those categories that doesn't have the 24 hour room service, this is where you can come and get a late night bite. Set all around the resort, you're gonna find jacuzzi hot tubs. This is one of the really large ones. And the reason I love this particular one is that you're right on the beach. So you see here, they have these two areas that head out. It's one of those places they utilize for a nice romantic dinner in the evening, but it's also a perfect spot to come take a picture. You've got the beautiful island in the distance and the sun sets just behind me. So you can see this is one of those idyllic spots on this resort, but there's quite a few of them as we tour the resort. This beautiful location is the Paradise Pool also set next to the Paradise Bar. We'll get there in just a second. So all around the pool, you've got these fantastic cabanas. You can come down and utilize them as you would like. You also have the loungers and the umbrellas all the way around. In the pool itself, you have seating. It's all literally all the way around the entire pool. And what I love is it's kind of meandering. So you've got this area here, and then it curves around to the other side. And so it's kind of a almost a, a three leaf clover, if you would. And it's really spread out and a great place to swim around, relax, and of course, that bar. I'll get there in just a second. You've got your hot tub right here, seating all the way around it as well. There's a couple outdoor showers set up. And then one of my favorite features is they've got a great fire pit over on the side there. Last night, I sat down there for a while, met some new people, had a drink and really enjoyed the time. Now, one other thing that I absolutely adore about this particular pool is the Paradise Bar. So it's a huge palapa structure here, and you've got several different types of seating. They have a tiered seating up top there with couches and love seats. You've got tabletops like you would for a regular restaurant. Now, the Paradise Bar does have seating in the water, and then, of course, the bar seating as well. But with any bar at an all-inclusive, it's the people that make all the difference. The bartenders here are awesome. They're gonna keep you on your toes, laughing, smiling, having a good time. And of course, keeping those drinks flowing, either from the bar here or in the pool itself. Now I talked a little bit about the cabanas. What I love about these is they're big enough for one or two couples. You can hang out with some friends here. You've got the coffee table for drinks. And then also these curtains will pull shut so you have a little bit more privacy if you would like. Now keep in mind, those are first come first serve. You can come down and grab them in the morning if you would like. 
Also around the pool, you're gonna find these towel stations, really nice and convenient, grab them whenever you're ready. And then of course you can just put the spent towels right down below. But once again, convenience at your fingertip makes your vacation even better. Now, of course, if you get hungry while you're around the pool, They've got bananas. No, seriously, this place is bananas. It is an incredible resort. And I love how they've taken such meticulous care with all of the landscaping throughout. Everywhere we've gone throughout the resort, we've seen that attention to detail. And of course, being that this has been a sandals resort for quite some time, you're gonna have all of the lush foliage that has grown in. One of those signatures of sandals. Another part of the Paradise Pool Complex is this incredible lagoon pool. It's recently built and it wraps all the way around all of these rooms here. So the bottom levels are all walkout swim up rooms. Of course, you can check those out on our channel as well. We have all of the different rooms and the full resort here. And then the other two resorts here in St. Lucia that you can stay at one, play at three. But what I love about this pool is that it is massive. So it starts all the way in the distance there. They've got a waterfall and the beautiful sandal sign. And then as we walk all the way around the pool, it's a very diverse pool. So you've got a shallow shelf over there where you're gonna have the chairs in the water itself. You've got waterfalls all around. So we're out here a little early in the morning. They haven't turned everything on quite yet. And you'll also see them around cleaning the pool. But it it looks absolutely beautiful. And what I really like is that you can swim as long as you want. You can wander around. And then of course, if you have friends staying over here as well, you can all utilize that. Now, in addition, of course, you have access to the Paradise Bar and Pool right up above as well. So they do drink service all the way around. Now on either side of the pool, they're gonna have a uh, bridge that heads up and over. It's a great place to check out all of it. But once again, this is a really phenomenal option. It's brand new and it looks incredible. Now my favorite part of the lagoon pool, a little bit of a pro tip here, are these seats at the end. So they have six of them over there by the sandal sign. You've got another four right here, but what I love is you've got that peace and quiet and tranquility with the waterfalls all around you. And then of course the bar service, and you can see how that extends on the other side as well. So you've got the traditional umbrellas and loungers, or dipping your toes in the water is my favorite place to sit. Just behind me, you'll see one of the many gazebos that they have here on site. You see the beautiful bougainvillea above it. You've got the hibiscus, flowers and foliage all around. What I love is there's so many places that you can tuck away. Now, Halcyon means peace and tranquility. This is one of those spots where you really can embrace that. You've got the ocean in the distance, maybe come and read a book during the day or take advantage of dinner in the evening. But I love that they've made gone out of their way to create all of these nice romantic spots where you can escape within the resort. We're headed into Bayside, which is the casual eatery here on site. So you do breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And you also have this great coffee station that you can utilize throughout your stay. Make your own espresso, latte, that type of thing. So there's a little bit of seating right up the stairs there. And let's head on in. So for breakfast, this is going to be a buffet. You see all the buffets all the way around. They'll have those set up for you. And then right here to my left, you're gonna have an egg station anything that they do that's made to order for breakfast, they're gonna do that right there for you. Now I mentioned that this is also a buffet lunch restaurant. So you can see all of these same spaces are utilized for lunch. Sometimes they'll have a few a la carte menu items as well. And then later on in the day, this turns into a dinner restaurant. So when it's a dinner restaurant, it's a French restaurant. So if you wanna have some escargot, chicken cordon bleu, some of your favorites, you can do that here. And for lunch, every single day they mix it up. So today was actually an Asian theme. They had an American theme. I believe they had a Jamaican theme as well too. So every day you can have a different option. And for lunch, you can take advantage of this or the beach bistro as well. But what makes this special is the location. You're set just off the main pool, but you're looking right out at the beautiful beach and water in front of you. You see you have these tables along there, but pretty much anywhere in the restaurant you can get that view. And what I appreciate about it is you also get that fantastic breeze coming right off of the water. Now, some people say Disneyland is the happiest place on earth. To me, it's soy. I love sushi. I love all-inclusive. You put them together. They do a phenomenal job here. So you can see they've got it set up right here at the bar. At this particular soy restaurant, they just have the sushi bar here, but of course you can have that outside as well. We'll show you the outdoor seating in a minute, but they've got all your favorite rolls. You got your nigiri, you got sushi, everything that you can imagine, and it's absolutely delicious. In fact, I usually have my first meal here before I go to my second one. But I think that's what an all-inclusive is all about. It's whatever it is that you personally want. Now also attached to soy, you're gonna find kimonos. This is a teppanyaki style restaurant. And what I love about that is it's interactive. It's kind of like dinner and a show. So you have fantastic chefs here that are gonna make it very interactive and fun. 
<laughs> I've been laughing still from the last time we dined here. Just having a great time. And then of course you can customize it. Who doesn't love fried rice? And then you have different choices from steak, you can have chicken, you can have fish. They do all of those different things. But once again, you can see here, they've got three of these. So there's one in the corner over here, two more right there. Just a fantastic option while you're on vacation. Just outside the restaurant, you'll find the outdoor seating area here for the sushi bar. So you've got the sushi bar inside, sushi outdoors as well. The setting that we're in is a Japanese style garden. You've got bamboo, you've got the flowing water, very zen-like. But the thing that puts me in a zen mood, it's sushi. Now we're just inside Mario's Italian Cuisine. Everybody loves Italian food, and this is a fantastic option here at Sandals Halcyon Beach. Now it's elevated Italian food, all the things that you would expect. You've got your pastas, lasagna, eggplant parmigiana is really good, insalata caprese. But if you love Italian food, you are sure to love this restaurant. Make sure that you stop by. You can see that you have seating for two, four, six. They can put them together for larger groups as well. But it's one of those things that I highly recommend you don't miss during your stay. One of the classic Sandals experiences is a private dinner for two. Candlelit, of course. If you prefer, you can have it down on the beach or you can have it in one of these beautiful gazebos right here. You see that they're just starting to set this up. They're gonna have it perfect for the couple later on today. But what this is all about is dining with the beach in the background. That's the only sound you hear is the nice waves lapping up and you can make it extra romantic. Now keep in mind, this is something that we can book for you even before you arrive. I highly recommend that you let us take care of all the details from the Island Roots tours the romantic dinners, all of that, even before you get here. So when you show up, all you have to do is kick back, relax, and enjoy paradise. When you picture getting married in paradise, every single person has a different idea of what that is. It could be right on this beautiful white sandy beach. It could be up on the lawn. That's what's so great about sandals is they include more than any other brand in the industry for their weddings, they do a phenomenal job at it. Their entire focus is on romance and they've been doing it longer than most companies have been around. They do an incredible job customizing from the very beginning. And as your travel advisor, of course, we take care of all the details for your guests and for you. We connect you with the wedding planner and then when you get here on site, you're gonna have a second meeting with them as well just to finalize all the details so that your wedding is exactly what you want. Now I'd love to show you one particular setup. Once again, your wedding is exactly what you want. This is a dream wedding for another couple. Now, as I mentioned, for some people, their dream is their toes in the sand. For quite a few others, it's not. This is a perfect setup right here for a beautiful sunset wedding. You see, this is set up for 24 guests. And what I like about it, you're right on the grass area here, but you're also just a couple steps away from the beach. So you kind of get the best of both worlds once again, as you like. Now let me show you a few options for a cocktail setup and the reception. Now Sandals offers a wide variety of customizations. And one of the things that I love is depending on the size of the wedding party, which you get to choose, there are all kinds of different inclusions. Now, as I mentioned earlier, we're gonna handle all of those details for you so you don't have to worry. But what I love about this is you have the wedding right there on the grass just in front of the beach. A few steps away, we've got the cocktail reception set up here. You see they've got the full bar lined up and ready for the guests. And then we're gonna head over to the other side to check out the reception. But once again, colors, customization, it's exactly what you want. To me, the appeal of a destination wedding is that you don't have to worry about anything at all. Everything's in one spot. They've done this so many times that they know the ins and outs and how to get it perfect just for you. You can see right here, you have a reception set up. They have beautiful market lights up all the way around. Extra decor, once again, you can customize that as you'd like add flowers, less or more, and then of course, all of the different decor. You see they've got the cake table set up over there. They're gonna arrange for that as well. So all you have to do is sit back, relax, let Har Travel take care of all the travel details, let Sandals take care of the wedding details, so you can enjoy your perfect day. Now keep in mind, there's two other stunning resorts right here on the island. And what a lot of people like to do is get married here and then maybe head over to the Grand St. Lucian. You can take advantage of one of those incredible over the water bungalows. We do have the video on our channel as well, but there's so many ways to make it exactly what you want. As soon as you arrive here on site, your car's gonna pull up right here and you've got the main reception just behind me. So they can take care of just about any of the details that you'd like throughout your stay here. But of course, if you're staying in one of the club level rooms, you can head over to the club sandals lounge and utilize those concierge services throughout your stay. 
Now the rest of the lobby is a bit of an extension of your living room. You can see here you've got the couches all the way around and chairs. That perfect space if you're waiting to meet people to go on a tour, relax, or just hang out before, well, the saddest part of your trip, heading home. Set just off the lobby, there's a couple very important desks that I wanted to point out. The first one is the Island Roots Tour Desk. Of course, you can plan a tour when you're here, but our high recommendation is you let us take care of all of those details even before you arrive. And I highly recommend if you're gonna visit an incredible place like St. Lucia, that you get out and explore the island as well. Now, once again, we can handle all those details even before you arrive. Next up is the loyalty and travel desk. This is where you can book your next vacation while you're on vacation. And the reason that we highly recommend it is that you can get prices and promotions that are only available on island at the resort here. And then of course, as soon as you get back, you let us know right away. We can handle all the details from there, but it is important that you let us know as soon as you get back so that we can handle that reservation for you. There's two desks right here. And then also tucked in the corner, you're gonna find the spa desk. This is where you can plan all of your different spa treatments while you're here. All of these things supplement your vacation and make it even more exceptional. So now we're just inside the beautiful Club Sandals Lounge. Once again, this is where you are going to check in if you're staying in a club level room. You're also gonna be able to take advantage of all of the excellent concierge service throughout your stay here. They're fantastic at what they do. They can assist with reservations, answer questions. They also have things like board games that you can borrow from here, books that you can exchange, things along those lines as well. Now, in addition to the couch seating here that you'll see, there's outdoor seating as well. And then over here, you're actually gonna find a full bar. It's gonna be an upgraded bar, actually more in line with what you'll find inside the butler level rooms. Uh, but I love that they have that upgraded option here. And then I always stop by to grab a coffee. So you've got an espresso maker, tea as you'd like. Set just off the lobby, you'll find Mirage. This is a multi-use space. So you can see right here, they have it set up in a conference style setup also can become the nightclub in the evening. They do entertainment with the stage up behind me. There's also a large piano over in the corner. They've got it tucked away right now, setting up for the conference, but it can also be a piano bar. Now, if it's a piano bar, you've got to have a bar. It's an extension of the IRE bar from outside. So you've got the outdoor and the indoor, but once again, a multi-use space that you can utilize for just about anything. Now, if you'd like to take advantage of a little retail therapy while you're here on site, you've got the duty-free shop right behind me. You're gonna find clothing items, different souvenirs from throughout the island, in addition to some of the sundries you may have forgot at home or you just wanna pick up while you're here. They also have a partnership with Columbia Inter Emeralds International. So once again, if you wanna take advantage of that duty-free concept, feel free to shop. Finally done with the tour for the day, time for a drink. Wait, what? Oh, 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 we're still going, my bad. All right, well, anyway, there are all of these fantastic spaces where you too can relax around the resort. We've got these beautiful bird nest loungers. They've got the hanging beds. They've got the hammocks and of course the swings. But all around the resort, you're gonna find incredible places where you can have a nice romantic moment or just sit back, relax and chill like I'm about to do in a few minutes. Mm. Beach. Just behind me, you're gonna find the Red Lane Fitness Center. It's also where you're gonna find the air conditioned treatment rooms for the Red Lane Spa. They don't have a full traditional spa here on site. They do most of the treatments all around the resort, on the beach, in the cabanas. But in here, you're gonna find that nice air conditioned one. And in addition to that, in the men's and women's locker room, you're gonna find the sauna and the steam room. Those are complimentary. You can use them as you'd like. So it's a nice combination to have the fitness, the sauna, the steam room, and of course, the treatment room in there. Now we're just inside the Red Lane Fitness Center here. You're gonna have everything that you need. You've got your cardio with an elliptical and some treadmills. You've got all the different circuit trainings as well, Smith machine, and then more weights, as well as the free weights and dumbbells on the other side, and leg presses. In the corner, they're also gonna have mats so you can do yoga, and they also do classes and personal training if that's something you're interested in. Sandals Halcyon, they do have a Red Lane Spa. They've got all of the different massages, facials, those kind of things that you've come to love. But what's unique about here is most of the treatments are done outside. They've got cabanas all around. You can also do it down on the beach as well. In here, this is actually the only one of the indoor rooms. So if you wanna have a nice air conditioned experience, you can see it's set up for a couple's massage right now. You've got the two beds, you've got that extra large tranquility soaking tub as well. So a perfect place for a nice romantic massage for two, whether you're celebrating an anniversary, a honeymoon, or well, heck, just wanna have a very relaxing time on vacation. 
One of the things that I love about how they do the spa here on site is you have this beautiful setting on the beach. You've got that breeze coming through. This is one of those examples of an outdoor massage. So you've got a couple's massage set up right here. You can have just about any of those different massage treatments that you'd like. Be spoiled and pampered, head back to your room, and then enjoy this incredible resort for the rest of the day. You can see all of the beautiful landscaping. It is meticulously attended to. And because they've had the resort for quite some time, you see it's very lush and full. I also love that all throughout the resorts, they have different day beds and well, the hanging ones, the, all kinds of different varieties. So now I'm gonna head into mine. Wait, what are you doing here? Always take my spot. There's all kinds of activities that you can take part in here on site if you want an active vacation. So you see here, you have two large tennis courts. They also have pickleball courts set up as well. So whatever it is that you'd like to do on vacation, you're probably gonna have the option here at Halcyon. I do like that it's lit. Of course, during the day, we're in the Caribbean, it can get a little bit warm and you may wanna be in the pool then. But what I love is earlier in the morning or later in the evening, you can turn those lights on and enjoy a game of tennis with your partner or with another couple. First off, congratulations for making it all the way through the tour and thank you so much for spending your time with us today. I hope you enjoyed everything that this resort has to offer, the incredible pools, bars, restaurants, and that fantastic beach behind me. In fact, I had an amazing dinner at Kelly's last night. It's one of the iconic restaurants here on site. So when you're ready to book this resort where you can stay at one and play at all three here in St. Lucia or any Sandals or Beaches resort, reach out to Har Travel. We are your luxury all-inclusive experts. We know the spaces inside and out and we have an amazing relationship with Sandals and Beaches resorts. And we know that we can craft the vacation of a lifetime for you, your friends, group, wedding party, or honeymoon at an incredible value. We done, Taylor? I'm going to get another lamb chop.